Hello everyone, this is Gage here from the Gage Brown YouTube channel and today we're going to be doing another computer overview and this is the Dell Latitude D630. Starting off we have is the Dell Latitude D630 itself. Um, right now it's charging, um, it's on half battery so I'm charging it right now as I'm filming. So this is the Dell Latitude D630 that was released in 2007, the same year as the Acer Aspire 5520 that I did in the last couple of videos. So, so this right here is the um, Dell Latitude um, and this is the, the charger itself which I'm going to show you later. So. Let's take a look at the on the bottom of the laptop itself. So right there, um, here's the bottom of the laptop itself. Um, as you can see, it has some information on there, um, the model number. Um, the input can take up to like 19.5 volts or 4.62 amps um, charge. And this right here is the the RAM cover. Um, underneath it has like um, RAM in there. Um, this one has two gigabytes of RAM. Um, right there is the Windows XP product key up there. Um, right there you also got the, the battery itself. Um, this is a replacement battery. Um, the original one no longer works. So this is the replacement itself. Um, and this is the hard drive itself. Um, this one has um, 160 gigabytes um, originally, but this was upgraded to 500 gigabytes. Um, and this was installed on a different operating system. Um, this originally comes in with Windows 7 Professional Service Pack 1 32-bit edition, but I decided to um, switch it over to Windows XP Professional Service Pack 3. So, so yeah, that's the bottom of the laptop itself. So. Let's get it on the, the desk and check it out. And before I start the laptop itself, um, I have the charger right there. Um, this is the Dell Latitude um, D630 charger. Um, this is actually um, the original one. Um, this right here can, um, can charge up with um, 100 to 240 volts or 1.6 amps and 500 through 600 um, hertz right there. Um, this is actually um, the charger that came in with the Dell itself. Um, here's the, the plug itself and here is the, the charger itself. So yeah that's, um, that's the charger. Um, let's take a look at the, the laptop itself. Um, so right here, um, let me get that out of the way. So right here is the CD and DVD drive, um, two USB ports up there on the side. And on the back, you also got the, the ethernet port modem, two USBs, um, VGA port, charger, this is where the charger goes, um, cooling fans, and on the side itself, um, this is where um, the card reader, um, like I remember those. So there's the Dell right there it actually um, holds the card so it can actually insert the internet card um, right there right now I'm just gonna put that back so I don't want to lose it there we go um, this is where um, the internet control like the switch you can like turn on the internet itself um, this is um, the 1394 um, connection right there. Get the headphone and microphone jack. And there's another, I'm guessing it's the speaker itself. Um, so yeah, that's basically on um, the bottom side of the Dell Latitude D630 itself. So let's open it up and see what we can access in there. 
And here it is, um, the Dell Latitude D630. Um, right here, um, this one um, was made and designed for Windows XP, which I actually um, have that on there. Um, this one has an Intel Core 2 Duo processor on there. Um, this is the keyboard itself, and it has like this trackpad right there. This blue um, track thing. Um, it's kind of like, um, it kind of reminds me of the IBM and Lenovo ThinkPads and HP Compact laptops back then. Uh, this is the keyboard itself. Um, there's only one thing um, that is wrong with this keyboard. Um, the E right there um, is a bit scratched up, but everything else is good. So the E is like, um, but the E key works. Um, this is the volume control up there, the power switch, and this is the, the num lock, number lock, caps lock, and the scroll lock. So this is a Dell Latitude D630. And you also got this um, track pad right there. So let's get this um, plugged in and turn it on. So hold on just a moment. All right, so I got the Dell Latitude D630. Um, all set up and ready to go. Um, here's a fun fact about the Dell Latitudes. Um, the Dell Latitude was first introduced by Dell in 1994, um, which is 30 years ago. Um, these laptops are designed for business purposes um, throughout the years. Um, this one's a former business um, computer that was retired and now, um, and now it's actually, um, currently has like uh, the replacements with the other Dell Latitudes with Windows 10 and Windows 11 on there and hopefully Windows 12 over in the future so um, in the meantime I remember growing up with Dell Latitudes in schools throughout the years before Chromebooks were, were replacing the Dell Latitudes so it's really nice that I finally get to see a Dell Latitude again after all these years. In fact, um, I actually did a video of the Dell Latitude D630 um, back in 2017. And the only two YouTubers um, who actually did a video on this is um, Billy Core from the Nostalgia Mall and the Retro Recall. Um, they both did the videos. Um, so Billy Core from the Nostalgia Mall did a video uh, back in 2014 and the Retro Recall, um, I don't know when, but Retro Recall did a video on this one. So now I can finally do a video on it. So, so without further ado, um, let's get started with the Dell Latitude D630. I'm just going to turn that on. So I'm going to access to the BIOS. And there we go. Um, this is the BIOS itself. Um, this is um, version A07, which is made on January 30th of 2008. So here's the processor. Um, this is the Intel Core 2 Duo processor with um, two gigahertz um, of current clock speed. And it can go up to like 2048 um, kilobytes um, here's the memory itself um, this one has um, two gigabytes of RAM in there um, this one has 500 gigabytes of storage on um, this one has a 500 gigabyte SATA drive in there um, and there's the battery itself this is actually um, can check the battery itself right now this one's 91% charging um, it's gonna be on to 100% so it's really cool that you can actually check the battery itself on there and the battery is actually working normally so you can actually visit, order a battery online on Dell but now it's not anymore but you can actually get it off on Amazon and eBay um, there's the date itself the date and time um, this was um, January 25th of 2024, um, a day after my 22nd birthday. Um, this is actually a, the devices itself. Um, 
I'm guessing that's the NIC card um, modem. Oh, a parallel port um, and a serial port. So those are going to be the back ones. Okay, now I understand. So the video itself, the security, performance. So right now I'm not gonna mess anything up. I just wanted this to show you. So let's get it out. So let's get out of the BIOS and go into Windows XP. There it is, Windows XP. Brings me back so many memories seeing it on a Dell Latitude D630. So yeah, I was actually a huge fan of Dell Latitudes um, throughout the years. Um, the first one that I saw was a Dell Latitude D531 uh, back around um, 2006 or 2007. And there it is, the Windows XP startup sound. Oh, um, I'm going to ignore that. Um, this always um, happens every time when I turn it on. So there it is, the Windows XP on the Dell Latitude D630 itself. Um, as you can see, um, I'm going to connect this mouse up there. Um, so the trackpad works. Um, I'm just taking some time to learn on using like the, um, the tracking point or trackpad. So I also got some software and games installed on there um, up to 2008 or 2009. I don't know about that. Um, I installed like a lot of um, games that I remember playing back then, even the ones that I currently playing. Um, so let's go to the my computer and here it is this one's running windows xp professional service pack 3 this is the volume licensed um, copy and it has um i've already mentioned it um intel core 2 dual processor with two gigs of ram and Excuse me. And um, let's take a look at that. You also got some music, pictures, and videos on there. Um, and this one is like Windows XP. Um, this was actually made on April 13th, 13th of 2008 um, is when the Service Pack 3 was released. Um, this is actually the last um, Windows XP Service Pack 3 um, before it ended support on April 8th of 2014. Um, so, and so this is actually, um, so I got some software installed on there, like um, some hip soft games like Build A Lot, Build A Lot 2, Dick Bees Donuts, Five Cart Deluxe, Flip Words 1 and 2, Gem Shop, Holiday Express, Jig Words, Ocean Express, and some Pop Cap Games, Puzzle Express, Sports Ball Challenge, Trivia Machine. I also got um, WinRAR up there, and 7-Zip, Video, um, VLC, Media Player, some Game House games up there. Five Card Dash, um, one of the games, Lost Media, um, card games and I also got um, Burger Shop on there so yeah um, so yeah that's um, the Windows XP itself um, here's the um, the Internet Explorer um, unfortunately Internet doesn't work um, so this one is Internet Explorer 6 from um, this was like around on Windows XP. Um, it was also available on the Windows 2000, 98, and MT, but it's a shame that this one did not work on Windows 95, I think. Um, here's Outlook Express 6. I also got MSN, Windows Media Player 9. 
and this is Windows Media Player 9 from 2002. Let me get the mouse. There we go. Um, Windows Messenger. I also got Tor Windows XP on there. So yeah, that's Tor Windows XP. Um, it also has Windows Movie Maker. I bet a lot of you um, YouTubers use this to make um, YouTube videos back in the mid 2000s. Um, kind of like with Windows Vista um, on the Acer S Fire 5520 that I did back then. Um, this one is version um, 2.1.1. 4026 and um, so yeah that's basically and this is the um, Outlook Express um, 6 um, no. I also got um, this is Outlook Express 6 from 2004 um, I also got um, Microsoft Office 2010 installed on there. So let's check out Microsoft PowerPoint 2010. There's the software itself. The PowerPoint. You make presentations on there. There's Microsoft Word 2010. Um, it really types up good, so I'm going to see if I can type it, see if it works. Yep, it works. 100%. So yeah, this was actually like um, included on the Dell Latitudes um, back then. This one has Microsoft Excel 2010. Spreadsheets. This was actually used as a spreadsheet to create graphs and everything. Um, so yeah, um, that's Office 2010. Um, let's try out some games on there. Um, let me lower the volume down. And before I start, I'm going to type in Winver. Here it is itself. Alright, so let's try out some games like... Bejeweled Deluxe. There we go. I'm going to do time trial.
Let me turn up the volume a little bit. All right, so that's Bejeweled Deluxe. Let's try another game, um, Alchemy Deluxe. <clears throat> Welcome to Alchemy. All right. Yes, I actually remember playing this game back then as well. So yeah, that's Alchemy Deluxe. Um, let's try um, Big Money. Big Money Deluxe by PopCap Games from 2002. Oh yeah, they come in on rare occasion, those dollar symbols that can get rid of the colors itself, like the yellow one for example, makes it easy to clean it, almost everything out.
And yes, I actually did made um, big money videos back in 2019, so. Here we go. Huh. Same rank as the last time. This one's one of my favorites. Fry cook of the month. All right, let's get out of there try and move on to another game itself um the next game is bejeweled 2 there it is bejeweled 2 let me turn up the volume a little bit Try the classic mode. This one has um, better graphics, unlike the, well, just like with the Acer, I think, but I'm not 100% sure about it. And um, speaking of this game, um, this game will be celebrating its 20th birthday, 20th anniversary um, in 2024 which is this year, so hopefully I can um, make a video of it as well. Well, that was that was easy. So yeah, um, hopefully in the future um, I'll make this video. Um, so right now, um, it's gonna take some time, so don't worry. Oh, looks like we got a fourth wall break. That orange gem just went through the screen. If it, it, it would come out of the screen and smacked in my face. That's scary. Anyway, so let's try um, next game. Um, chuzzles. Haven't done chuzzles on this video. All right.
That was cool. Alright, um, you know, I'm just going to finish the level and then move on to another game itself. There we go. Get out of here. All right, next is Dynamite Deluxe. Um, this is actually um, the 22nd anniversary of Dynamite Deluxe, um, which is today as of this recording. All right. Yes, I also remember this game as well. In fact, I did remember a lot of PopCap games growing up back then. All right, let's move on to another game itself. Um, which one? Um, let's do Zuma. Oh, I gotta put in the name right there. Here we go. That was easy. Oh wow, that's better than the last time I done it on on an Acer Aspire video. That was easy again. 
Wow, much better than the last one that I did. All right, let's do another level. Wow, that was good. Must have been doing better. So let's do level four since I um, haven't done that. Yes, I remember this game as well. Um, like I said before. So after that, um, go to another game itself. There we go. There we go. Not bad. All right, let's check out another game. All right, so I found another idea, um, Digby's Donuts. This is the game that I remembered um, back then. All right. Where are we going? San Francisco, California. I already know how to play it, so I don't need to worry about that. Yep. That's a double. Not really, but twice. Well, that was easy. All right. This is the bonus round. All right, we got a perfect one. Incredible, that's right. All right, let's um, get out of here. All right, let's try another game, Five Card Deluxe. To challenge mode.
All right, so let's make a pair and two pairs. Hmm. Royal flush. That's nice. Oops. There we go. All right, let's save that for now. All right, let's try a next game. All right, so let's try a next game called Gem Shop. This was released by Hipsoft in 2005. <clears throat> I actually remember playing this game on Real Arcade back then. So this game is actually available on Real Arcade Games Preservation Project. So let's get started. So basically it's like chuzzles and bejewel together, but instead of chuzzles, it's like gems, jewelry, and diamonds in there. Let's get some tokens. There we go. All right. So that's Gem Shop. Um, let's try another game. Um, let's see what we got. Um, let's do um, Jig Words. So there's Jig Words, a word puzzle game combination from 2005. You can add in some photo packs in there. There's the scores. No, I don't want to download those. So it has two game modes, some game modes. One's jig words, the other's um, letter racing, which this game doesn't work anymore. Let's do, um, the original. Well, that was easy.
There we go. Got a picture of a bumblebee. All right, let's go to another level. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. All right, we got a word duel going on. There we go, got a sunflower. Flutter. There we go. All right, let's just um, save that for now. All right, so let's go to the next game. <clears throat> Ocean Express. Welcome to Portland, Portland, Maine. So, 
So this is the first time I'm trying out Ocean Express on um, on my YouTube video. So There we go. Let's get that out of the way. Oops. There we go. Oh wow, that's perfect. All right, let's save the game. All right, so let's try another game. Um, Puzzle Express. Let's do the relaxing mode. Welcome to Seattle, Washington. No, that's not it. There we go. There we go. That's everything. Whoops. Whoops again. There we go.
There we go. All right. Let's go to the next game. <clears throat> Going to do Sports Ball Challenge. One of my favorite um, games growing up back then. All right. Let's do soccer as always. Here we go. Let's go for hockey. Let me turn that down a little bit. Oops, missed one. There we go, 6,000. Let's go for football. All right, congratulations, a new sport has been unlocked, basketball. Let's go for it. This one. All right. 
guess that's it. Um, let's check out some software like um, WinRAR. Um, there's 7-Zip. Um, this one's version 9.38 beta from 2015. And also got Video Land on DLC Media Player. Some game house games. Um, let's do Mad Caps. One of my favorite games growing up back then. All right. That was easy. All right, let's try Luxor. All right. All right, let's go to the next level.
There we go. There we go. All right. All right, so let's try Aloha Solitaire. I'm gonna put that in full screen. There we go. Has the nice um, atmosphere. So basically, it's like um, memory. You have to like um, match two of them. There we go. Winner. All right. All right, let's go to burger shop. That was easy. That was easy as well. 
And now for fries. Can't go wrong with fries. Ooh, an ultimate bundle. Cheeseburger with fries and a drink. Ooh, another one. All right, that's it. All right, so let's check out that game. Um, that was actually um, believed to be Lost Media, and it's called Five Card Dash. That was made by um, Cognidoy, um, and it was released in 2002, so... This is actually a first video footage. So it's like Tetris, but instead of blocks, it's cards. This is only the demo trial, unfortunately, so no full version is available yet. All right. So yeah, that's Five Card Dash. Not to be confused with Five Card Deluxe, so... Actually, it's a full house. All I need is a seven. Finally.
Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh. There it is. Yep, this is the demo version, unfortunately. Um, only the full version is lost, um, unfortunately, especially with the real arcade version. So all I have to, is the demo. Um, all right. Not bad at all. So if anybody has the, the full version of the game, please let me know. Even if the, if you have the real arcade version of this game, it would be better. So please let me know if you have the full version because, um, this game has almost been lost to time, so if anyone's in the Lost Media Wiki, um, please let me know in the comments so I can um, get this game on the Lost Media Wiki. Um, so, unfortunately you can't purchase it because the servers have been shut down um, in 2009. So yeah, um, that is basically about it for now. Um, let's check out some accessories on um, the calculator. So this one actually does math.
Oh, that was easy. A one. All right, let's check out um, Minesweeper. And I won again. Very easy. Oh, one second as well. And got pinball as well. Yep, there's pinball. Do um, left and right. There we go. Up oh, so close. Wow. Happens a lot. I mean, I, I can't believe it. That's about it for now. Um, let's see. Any... There's internet um, games on there, but unfortunately, um, it no longer works because they actually... Um, turned off the servers um, a couple years ago so free selling hearts on there um, there's also um, there's also um, internet stuff on there um, so yeah I guess that's basically about it for this um, video um, this is the Dell Latitude D630 from 2007 with Windows XP Professional Service Pack 3. So I hope you um, enjoyed the video. So let me turn that off. All right, so I guess that's it. All right, guys, so that is it for this um, video. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.